Hello there everyone, my name is Alexander V, uh, you can call me A5 if you would like. Um, I'm here today to actually narrate to you one of the most interesting s stories the world has to offer. It is simply a story of a fellow Reagan that's gonna be someday a new droid, alright? You can follow along with the progression, feel free to subscribe if you want uh, to see more episodes, so I'm just gonna leave you to it, alright, snap. It all started on a place called Tower on the Wall, where I legally appropriated some of the trinkets. After that, I worked my way down, so I started with plunging carefully from the mountain. Once I was down, I found that there is water everywhere, so I just started hopping on the water, working my way to Sentinel. I know hoping can actually define the, the laws of physics, but who cares, right? Um, on my way, uh, I had some couple of problems, so I was actually heading to, towards uh, the crypt. And some strange, strong warrior has actually just came up to me that came out of nowhere and he started trying to punch me. Well, I could uh, avoid most of his punches, but like he headed me once, which actually got like it, it was it was so painful because I lost a lot of brain cells. So, but like it's okay. I mean, that I heard later that that punch has actually gone um, f uh, far and wide. So, yeah. Um, you know, it all started with pain, like, nothing, nothing will, just know that everything will start with pain, okay? So, after that, I decided to back off and leave him to it, so I just decided to go to sleep. Next day, um, I got awake, like, I, I slept on the water, yeah, I know what you're thinking, yeah, I did. So, once I woke up, I, I didn't need breakfast, because, you know, I'm rigging, I don't eat. So, I just, uh, headed to, towards the... Uh, the crypt again, and this time there were no one. There was no one near, which is actually so good. So I started by again uh, legally appropriating some of uh, the properties that I do not own. So I just took them because you know, it, I mean, w why would you drop them there? Like, yeah. After that, I hid it inside the the crypt. Although I know it's an ambush, but I just still got inside. I don't know why, but like, yeah. So after that, um, I was just running in circles, you know, because they're animals, the reaction time is, I mean, probably shriekers are animals, you know, because they're, they're dumb as fuck, like, look at that reaction time, you know what I'm saying? So, um, all I had to do was actually run in circles, and they couldn't actually keep up with me. Uh, 60 minutes later, the door finally opened. And, um, once I actually gone out, all the shriekers were on me, so I had to separate them, so I used my intelligence for that matter. So all I did was actually keep, kept on running until they, um, got separated on themselves. Um, I mean, yeah, it's cool, right? It does all the job for me. Uh, but animals, you know what I'm saying? Animals. After that, uh, I just took one, and I started punching the shit out of him. Why? Because, I don't know, I felt like it. I'm just kidding. So I can unlock my mana. I'm sorry my fellow shrieker, but like, I have to do this. Alright, so uh, a few punches later, my guy got knocked out, so I just uh, decided to finish his suffering. Uh, so I did this. After that, uh, I decided, because I needed to, uh, I needed more violence, so I decided to separate the rest. And I took a one again, and I actually beat the shit out of him. Knock him, and do that. I don't know what that's called, but yeah. Uh, straight to Sentinel, I bought the armor. I mean, after selling, of course, I bought the armor, and um, then I worked my way to Renova. Why Renova? So I can actually farm um, some scrooms and lava flowers, so I can make them them health potions for the ultimate skills.
So after all of that intense farming, I had a total of 62 health potions. I mean, 61 health potion and one chestbin potion. Um, so I decided to go straight ahead to get my alchemist skills because I know for botanist you only need two, uh, not max for botanist. All right. So I went ahead and to the Isle of Heat. I don't know what is it called or if I spelled it right, but I went there. Um, I speak to the old man. So here you see only one conversation, but he actually gave me the two skills in one. I don't know how that works. Uh, I mean, I got tricked as well. So I went back and I farmed some more because I thought that I don't have enough, uh, enough potions made already. So I went back and I made some more, but it was actually enough. Um, after that, when I realized that it is enough and that I can actually double pick up, uh, basically I didn't realize that I can double pick up. Like I just noticed that I have a lot, a lot of um, ingredients in my pocket, and I only farmed once. So, I said maybe I already got uh, the skill already because you see in the wiki they only say you need sixty two for two um for two skills. So after that I went ahead and searched for Falion, and I picked up two of his skills. Uh, then I needed uh, more silver, so I went ahead and uh, you know you know you know the drill. Uh, appropriated some of the people's uh, properties, of course that I do not own. And I have no rights to own them, but I did it. Called the cops, help. Alright, so I did it. Then I went to a merchant and he scammed me. But it's, um, I don't know. I, I don't care. I mean, I stole that. So, yeah. After that, I went and get my Falion skill. After that, um, I farmed a little bit more of silver and sentinel, wayside, the crypt. Um, uh, from here and there, you know what I'm saying? Uh, after that, I sold all of my stuff. I went ahead and I got two of my botanist skills. Uh, so we only need like 80 more for the last skill. So I'm just gonna go ahead and farm for it in video. So uh, I just run up to a small issue. So basically, when I went to talk to the NPC, he just simply said that basically I don't have the second alchemist skill, which is quite weird because I've done a lot more potions than I should do um, so all I've done is that I went back to Renova I farmed screws and uh, lava flowers I made like I farmed like 50 then I made like 25 potions and um, I talked to the alchemist and he he gave me the skill this time so this time I do have the second skill so I do have the money too so all I have to do is simply go and sell my stuff and max out the super class. Alright, so the super class is finally maxed. Um, uh, that will be it for this video though, alright? So this will be it. If you want to see the next episode, just stay tuned. It will be uh, uploaded soon because I'm aiming for the Uber. So I'm going to try to rush as I can the both super and ultra classes. Maybe the ultra class will not be that easy as the super but like pretty sure we can do it. We did this at day two, which is uh quite really great in my opinion. We don't even have max climb. Um well we did good. So this this will be it for this video. I hope you're um yeah, I hope you're you stay at home and uh happy quarantine. Alright. So um see you see you next next video.